Red Oak Creek Bridge has character, but not much else. It looks like a horse and buggy should be crossing it, rather than the hundreds of cars that commute to Dallas by way of this bridge each day. Norman Gammon nearly died because of the Red Oak Creek Bridge. Last Thursday, he went over the 20-foot embankment, which parallels the bridge. And Gammon says he knows of four other serious accidents so far this year on the bridge. Well, right at the beginning of the bridge, the bridge changes angles. And uh, the bridge has wooden runners on it, and uh, when you try to change angles right at that bridge, if it's wet, your car fish tails, and when you get it to the end of the bridge, you have no alternative if your wheels aren't straight at that time, well, you nose off down in an embankment, and that's exactly what happened to me. As you can see, there are no guardrails on the side of the bridge to prevent a skidding car from dropping 20 or 30 feet. There are no signs on either side of the bridge warning the motorist that the bridge is slippery when wet, and no reflector lights to help the motorist see at night. Gammon says he called County Commissioner Ralston after his accident. He says Ralston said he would check the bridge when he got an opportunity, but Gammon says Ralston didn't seem too concerned about it. Well, I felt like that it was just a routine thing with him and that it would just pass over with the next, by the next day and uh, anything that can cause this serious of an accident and cause four accidents in one year's time, I think that there needs to be some kind of an investigation whereby that this problem can be corrected.